Well, guys, it is a restaurant week, and that means it is the perfect time to check out any of the new restaurants. And speaking of new restaurants here in our area, there's a new one that we're about to feature. Ooh. I know, I'm super excited. Vu Corre just opened up a couple of months ago, and their owner, Corey, is joining us now this morning. Good morning, Corey. Thanks for joining up with Krim. Oh, good morning. Thank you. Oh, good morning. And, you know, Vu Corre is new to the town, new to the area. Uh, tell people a little bit about what it goes on there and what it's all about. So we're a New Orleans inspired restaurant down right by the courthouse on the corner of Broadway and Cedar in a hundred and hundred plus year old building. So it really does have the New Orleans feel to it. Oh, it sounds love nice. It. And I love New Orleans food. I don't know. Same. That. I yeah. love the food there. All mm -hmm. of the, like the shrimp, like shrimp and grits, all of these kinds of mm -hmm. things, those flavors. Yeah, so many good flavors. Now, are you doing all New Orleans inspired dishes? Admittedly, I have seen pictures on social media because I was so curious and I know the answer, but tell us a little bit about some of the dishes you have to offer there. So we have anything from gumbo to jambalaya. We have fried chicken for those of you that don't like seafood. I have um, a crawfish boil while they're in season, which the season's getting getting to the point where it's winding down a little bit. So, um, but we do have that. We have, um, let's see, like I said, we have the bacon wrapped shrimp and grits. We have fried cat. So, yeah. Oh man, so tell us what are some of the specials that you have going on for restaurant week? Because everything sounds amazing already. We have, we really tried to showcase some of our main dishes in really the New Orleans inspired. So we have gumbo, we have jambalaya, we have red beans and rice, we have the bacon wrapped soup and grits. And while we have them, we do have the crawfish boil on that menu also. Um, they are in a little bit of a short demand just because um, some of the traps were robbed actually on the Snake River. Wow. So if we run yeah if we do run out we're going to offer the catfish oh so. wow okay that, catfish. yeah that <laughs> all sounds amazing i'm extremely excited and uh, me personally i'm like oh i don't want someone else to take my spot is yeah. there a way to make reservations or is it first come first serve no we do take reservations and we are filling up very quickly so the only way to do reservations is to call the restaurant because we do have to be able to juggle things and move tables around so just go ahead and give us a call for a reservation Oh, love Absolutely. it. Great idea. Yes. Now I know what I'm doing after this. Yeah. Calling right. and making a reservation. All right. Well, <laughs> Carrie, I'm sorry. We got to go. It's uh, all goes by way too fast, but we're going to send it off to commercial and I'm going to pick up the phone and call so I can get a reservation. Oh, you beat me to it. Thanks so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. Bye. Bye.